Limit and continue. Learning outcomes. To find outside one sided limit. When limit at approaches A from the right, Fx equal L. Second one, limit at approaches A from the left, Fx equal M. For E, determine the existence of the limit. When limit approaches A from the left, Fx equal limit A, X approaches A from the right, Fx equal L. F, find infinity limits. Limit approaches A, Fx equal positive infinity. Limit X approaches A when Fx equal negative infinity. Find limit at infinity. Limit X approaches positive infinity. Fx equal L. Limit X approaches negative infinity. Fx equal M. H find limit at approaches A FX over GX when limit at approaches infinity FX and limit at approaches positive infinity GX are indefined. Discuss for limit at approaches positive infinity 1 over x to the power of n equals 0 and limit at approaches negative infinity 1 over x to the power of n equals 0 for n greater than 0. Study this example. Your function f x equal x square minus 9 over x minus 3. For this function, your domain is negative infinity to 3, union 3 to infinity. Okay, from the x square minus 9, you can factorize, you can get limit approaches 3 from the left. For function x minus 3 times x plus 3 over x minus 3, you can eliminate x minus 3. And your, you can get limit x 3, limit x approaches 3 from the left. Then you can substitute x equal 3. 3 plus 3 equals 6. Okay, this is your condition from the graph. You can see 3 from the left. You can substitute and get the 6. And for limit x approaches 3 from the right, also you can solve by the same same process and get fx equals 6 also. Okay, when your x approaches 3 from the right, you can see your you can your point from the right 3 and from the left 3, you can get same answer equal 6. Therefore, limit x approaches 3, fx equals 6. Therefore, the limit of this function is called a two-sided limit. Study the example. fx third x minus 1. For this function, your domain is x greater equal 1. This is your graph. Okay, when your x equal 1, your, z, your y equal 0. This is your point. Okay, let me x approaches from the right. fx equal 0. Because when you substitute 1 inside this function, you get square root 1 minus 1 equals 0. And limit x approaches from the left, fx does not exist. Because when you substitute 1 from the left, the example 0, x equals 0, you can get inside set is negative. If negative inside set, we can make a conclusion fx does not exist. Okay, for this case, limit x approaches 1 fx from the right is 0 only. Therefore, the limit of this function is called a one sided limit. One sided limit, one sided limit can either be a right hand limit or a left hand limit. Left hand limit. Limit x approaches a from the left, fx equal l. Therefore, uh, of f as x approaches a from the left is l. Okay, this is a situation for the graph. We can see when your x approaches a from the left, you can get y equal l. Right hand limit. Limit x approaches a from the right, fx equal m. The limit of f as x approaches a from the right is m. 
Okay, we can see from this graph when your x approaches a from the right, you can see you can get m. m is the value for y. That's for existence of limit. If limit x approaches a from the left, fx, equal limit x approaches a from the right, fx, equal l, we can make a conclusion, limit x approaches a, fx, equal l. Because limit from the right, a, and the left, a, left side, a, you get the same answer. Limit exists at x equal a. If limit x approaches a from the left, fx not equal limit x approaches a from the right, fx. Therefore, limit x approaches a, fx does not exist at the point a. Sketch the graph and determine the limit of the flowing function. Limit x approaches for fx if fx equal x square x not equal 4 and 0 when x equal 4. B, limit x approaches 0 fx if fx equal x square for x less than 0 and 1 plus x for x greater than 0. Solution. This is your graph. You already learned for this how to sketch this graph piecewise function. Fem. Okay, when you to find limit, when your limit x approaches 4 from the left fx equal limit x approaches 4 from the left from the left x square, your function from the left equal x square, therefore you can get, you can substitute 4 inside this x, you can get 4 square equal 16. For limit x approaches 4 from the right, ff, your function also x square. Then you use, use, you can substitute 4 inside this function and your answer is also 16. Limit x approaches for fx equals 16 because you have the same answer from the right and the, and the left. For second example, this is your graph for piecewise function. Limit fx, x approaches 0 from the left, equal limit x square, x approaches 0 from the left, you can substitute your 0 inside this function, you get, get 0. For limit x approaches from the right, fx, your function for from for the left side equal 1 plus x when you substitute 0 you can get 1 therefore limit from the right not equal for limit from the left you can make a conclusion limit x approaches 0 fx does not exist example 2 limit x approaches from the right for absolute value x over x and limit x approaches 0 from the left for absolute value x over x does the limit x approaches 0 absolute value x over x exist? Okay, solution. Absolute value x equal for definition absolute value x equal x for x greater equal 0 and negative x for x less than 0. Okay, from this definition when your limit x approaches 0 from the right, you must substitute absolute value x with the positive x. Because from the right, x, your function is x for absolute value x. When you substitute x for absolute value x, when your condition x approaches 0 from the right, you can get 1. For limit x approaches 0 from the left, you can substitute your absolute value x with the negative x. Therefore, you can get x. Limit x approaches 0 from the left equal negative 1. Okay, for this case, limit from the right 0 and limit from the left 0 not have the equal answer. That's why, therefore, limit x approaches 0 for absolute value x over x does not exist.